Frank. Speaking of Nick, this should be a good set. Um, yep, Nick Whittier, uh, I think, is the favorite here, but I could definitely see Nat doing it. Now, it, that said, I think he's also the favorite, but Nat definitely has a lot of practice in this matchup, playing with him. <laughs> yeah, so, yeah. So, um, but they they do play a bit different. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm not even sure. I feel like Lord is kind of one of the oh, crispy. Give him the crisp. Uh, I feel like Lord is one of those players where it's like, yeah, I play him all the time, but that's not really Falcon practice, you know? I get like, uh, Kenny, you said that about my puff. He's like, you don't play, you play like a weirdo, you don't play like a normal <laughs> puff, so you're not actual puff practice. And I was like, well, okay. I feel like that's the same way for Lord. You play so wily and, and weird. Be a lot of heavy punches in this matchup. We saw it didn't take many hits from either of them to lead the chain to a Oh kill. yeah, yeah. This matchup, if <laughs> for some reason y'all y'all figured it out, uh, Falcon just spends the whole time trying to open Marth up because he has a heavy punish game on Marth. Yeah. Um, Marth just plays kind of keep out and has really easy hmm. kills on Fal like his edge guarding game on Falcon is so rough. Yeah. It's almost, in cer certain situations, we're like guaranteed. Um, and his combo game is really good too. Like he, he definitely can tear Falcon apart. But once Falcon is inside, like most smash ups with Marth, Marth just gets tossed. Yeah. Literally tossed. It's been pretty tight thus far. Nat got a little unlucky a second ago. He tricked Nick when the air dodge to the stage and he got battlefielded. Oh yeah, yeah, I saw that. Enough times at Ridgemont High. Oh, she'll drop a bear. Yeah, oh. that's uh, that's what Nick M. Whittier is like his signature thing is shield dropping a lot. Yeah, well that was actually Nat who did that. Oh, I'm sorry. I looked away for a half second and I played assumptions. <laughs> I think yeah, it's not a bad assumption if yeah. you're trying to say she'll drop a bear. <laughs> it was Nick. Yeah. Okay. So I like I like the uh, Nat spin. I was talking a bunch of smack about Nat's uh, Marth at the Arcadian about it's like overly aggressive, uh, but he's been just playing way more keep out and patient, which I like yeah. because it makes more sense for a switch. Because he was yeah. still playing like a fox. You know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm sure you played him, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I haven't played his Marth that much actually. Um, I'm sure it's hard to shake that mentality though. If you're used to playing fox and kind of being able to move in when you want, like oh, yeah. moving to Marth, um, definitely. I'm sure it's an adjustment. But um, he's definitely been making uh, good little adjustments like that. Yeah. Oh, no okay, there. that's a Falcon move, but I'll take it. Let's go. Yeah, technical area there. I think it was a short hop fair there. Oh. oh, I was a little worried that that was some overextension on Nat's part. Oh, Tomahawk Grand. Well, oh, he's inside. Oh, I don't like that. I would rather have him like up aired and try to set up for an edge guard. Oh, okay, but you know. I think that was pretty good DI by Nick there. Like, it created an edge guard situation, but he was going to get dared. Oh, that nice. nair that Nat just got was like, I swear that was reading his, uh, Nick's shield drop. Or a shield pump. But I think, I think I want to say. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, Nick, Nick, can be, Nick can be fairly predictable with his shield drops because he often kind of pauses before he does it. Uh -huh. um, he so. tries to, I think he tries to read when you're going to hit his shield. I don't think he reacts to it mm -hmm. that much. Mm -hmm. I could be wrong. He might he might go watch this back. Be like, hey, Brian. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I think, yeah, I think um, I think we'll see Nick maybe. Okay, never mind. I was going to see my platform camp a little more, but uh -huh. he wants no class. Um, okay, we got a neutral start here. Okay. I, I think this is a good pick. I think Falcon, m most of his matchup, I mean, you could... Agree or disagree with me as a Falcon man? I think most of his matchups kind of sucks here. I agree with that mostly. Yeah, like, um, but not this one. I, I don't know actually. Well, I'm speaking like okay, space animals. He gets <laughs> mollywop, right? Mm -hmm. Um, I don't know. I guess I, it depends on the playstyle because Puff might be good or bad, right? What do you think about? Uh, I don't have a strong opinion about Puff Falcon on this stage. Okay, um, Peach gets he gets chain grab, right? Yeah, but he's a lot of space to run around though. Um, I think that one's probably. I mean, it's you just can't mess up, right? You can't really ever mess yeah. up, right? So yeah, he I gets mean, combo hard everywhere. Like that's true. Uh, but I think taking away the platforms has been good because he's not mm -hmm. been getting anything from them. Really, nice ledge like, tech. Nat's just been keeping him up there and mm -hmm. punishing him. So yeah. this is a good pick. I like it. I actually feel like um, I feel like he probably went here because like punish wise, he feels like um. 
Because one thing, the one reason this is nice is because once you get Marth in the air with a grab or like a stray hit, like oh, the, the yeah. combo potential is pretty strong. Yeah, because it's like he can, he can come down and you still kind of screwed. Yeah. Right. Yeah, I think that's the reason uh, that he picks us against Sheik as well. So on paper you're thinking, oh, well he just gets tech chased to death, but yeah. uh, keeping him up in the air is probably nice. <laughs> probably good. I think Nick's starting to dash dance a little more. He had been yeah. kind of stationary. Yeah, um, I think it, maybe he just wasn't comfortable with the small space. Mm -hmm. uh, and Battlefield was actually the biggest stage he could have gone to, mm -hmm. right? Because no one's gonna, Mark's not going to take him to Dreamland. Yeah. Land. Possibly Stadium? Possibly. Yeah, well, uh, oh, that's a Oh, pick. very nice. We and uh, yeah. we see this. Yeah. Um, yeah. That but that, that's the sort of thing I was talking about right there, right? Caught him with one up air. Yep. And then from there... Nice um, conversion. I liked it. I think Nick got a lucky oh. there. That that got crouch canceled, but he didn't grab out of it. Throw it out the counter. Mm. It's a dangerous life. Okay. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. I would have probably gone for some stupid. Yeah, I thought he was going to try to, like, <laughs> dare or something. Yeah, especially because, like, you know when they turn around and they don't immediately wave dash? You think that they're just going to do something silly? Mm -hmm. You know? I think that's just because they, they, like, mess up the wave dash, though. Feels like Nat has a pretty good read on Nick's dash chances. Like, and when yeah. he's gonna, he's hit him out of quite a few. Okay, as yeah, I say he's that, he's just doing. As no, I, say I, that. I do agree with you though. <laughs> he's just whiffing. He's just throwing out dumb moves. But I think, I think it's one of those things. You know, you ever like, you, you really like you're reading somebody, but you right. can't, can't stop yourself from doing stupid stuff. Ooh, oh my okay. god! Yeah, I think <laughs> he, he didn't di that there too well. Okay. Oh man. So Nick's been trying to... Okay, so this is exactly what I was talking about. This right? is exactly what I was talking about. Uh -huh. He just gets one clean nair on him, like 60% off of it. Uh -huh. um, I think one thing Nick would like is that um, at a down throw, he hasn't... Oh, oh wow. the runaway DI. And yeah, I got that, the is, runaway. that is all um, she wrote this night. But I've noticed like Nick's been trying to re-grab off the down throw, but Nat is like kind of DIing like up, it seems like. And you know, he's probably Nick is probably reading the DI away, so he's trying to run uh, in and, and regrab. Yeah. But Nick's or Nat is kind of like DIing up and in, sort of it looks like. And so he's running past him. So smart stuff. Time. You're saying yes, Mute City, dude. I'm down for Mute City. <laughs> I I I'm surrounded by a bunch of <laughs> fast fallers. <laughs> Y'all don't know. Right. No. Mute City is the right. shit. So we're gonna stadium. That that dude. <laughs> I love Mute City. I would do, totally be down for that back. Okay. Press one if you want to bring Mute City back, and two if you want to bring Mute City back. And we got man, I he he just can't keep uh, Nick out. Yeah, he can't. Um, he's also Nick uh, actually being aggressive. He, yeah, <laughs> <laughs> like unusual. Nick has sped up. Um, yeah. I mean, he is the favorite oh. here. But oh no. No, oh, okay. okay. I would have okay. actually opted to go for the tipper there. I feel like, for some reason, the uh, dare shouldn't work twice. But mm -hmm. that is a funky ledge, right? Mm -hmm. So I guess that works out. Nice down tilts. Like, Nat's trying to implement a lot of, like, pivot stuff. Mm -hmm. And I'm, I'm not sure... Oh, that was a Raptor boost? What? <laughs> yeah, he probably meant the Raptor boost. That's the only thing I can assume. I wanted to uh, see... You know what Jeff would have done? Like, a, a double jump there, right there. Nick is excellent. Smirk. Nick is excellent at stomping on platforms. I was watching him practice stomping on platforms, and he was he was getting he was on battlefield on the right like platform. Like spacing, or and he what? was well. He, there was a fox standing under the platform on the battlefield, and uh -huh. he was doing stomps, and he was hitting him. I didn't even know you could do that. Oh, from below? Yeah. I yeah, just, yeah. You can nipple uh, pop him up with the nipple. Why are you down here, Nat? Okay. Why did you go? I want you to listen to me. And tell me, dude, look at how many people want to bring back Mute City. That guy <laughs> wants to bring back Mute City 12 times. Who does that guy play? Does that guy play a floaty? Probably. Uh, I don't think that's important. <laughs> 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 Let's just assume they're all Foxes and Falcons. Especially Falcons. Haven't you seen Pink Shinobi vs. Silent Spectre? I have. Exactly. So that means it's viable. <laughs> <laughs> so, that has been increasingly... Um, Throwing out some oh. attacks on shield. That was a pretty clever rapid boost there. Yeah. Um, I like the soft bear. It's really safe. Yeah, so now was in the danger zone a little there, because I mean but he, he got the kill, but um We've seen Nick do some kind of one touch kill stuff, so Yeah. I mean Marth I don't I honestly don't think Marth's like that good at touch to death in this matchup. I yeah, think I he gets like touched to like 
50 to 80 percent. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think like touch to positional advantage to edge guarders. Yes, absolutely. Uh, I think. I think. Sorry, I interrupted. Net. I feel like Net has been at his best in this matchup when he's um he's been doing a lot of like empty hops. <laughs> okay, continue. Like Net's been doing a lot of empty hops. Oh, that was a bad full hop, but he didn't. Nothing really happened. Um, so Nick's starting to go through the platforms a little more. Mm -hmm. I mean. You definitely yep. don't want to be on a platform as Marth if they're below. You just don't want to be above them like that. Mm -hmm. You just get whooped. I wonder if Mi Nick meant to knee on that up air. Oh. Um, we got a little bit of a crowd gathering. Uh, to watch this. Kenny. Kenny is not a crowd. He's a buster. <laughs> Kenny is a buster. That is a well-known. <laughs> well-known. If you look up Kenny Kwan on Wikipedia, it just says buster for eight pages. Okay, that was a good uh, forward tilt. Uh, Ooh, okay. Okay. Here we go. Nat's so not choking. Go? Nat's Marth doesn't choke. It's a hero. Even though he's putting himself on this spot, he, he lost. So, uh, yeah, he I, that, that was very Maybe questionable. Not. It was yeah. very questionable. Baited. If he, if, he, if, he were to, if he had been up air off that platform, he probably would have lost. Could, could, couldn't have uh, up tilt reached there? I'm not sure. Oh. I think up tilt would have been... Uh, he wants to get, like, he's gotten so much more off of his juggles than his tech chases, is what I've noticed. So, uh, Nat? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. So I, I think he should be opting for more juggly, oh, more juggle nice. guys. Oh, we hit to, this is a, we oh, hit him straight up. That come down was so important. If he, like, throw out a back air or something stupid, done. Mm -hmm. But it doesn't matter. Good stuff to, uh, Nick. Nat, Nat a little upset, but understands yeah. that it's all part of the greater good.